John, as always, thanks for uh, joining us post-match here. Um, how'd you sum up today's 90 minutes? Well, it's once another game that we've shot ourselves in the foot again, you know. We've, uh, we've beat ourselves you know, again, unfortunately. Uh, you know, there's nothing in the game at all. I thought we were a better team overall. Overall, I think we created more chances in them. I can count uh, Jamie Barjonis for having three shots in the first half. Tony Dingwall having three shots, Kevin Nisbet having about two shots, all for good positions, all for good areas, and we didn't have a, a goal to, to show for that. I can think of them having, well, they scored the goal, which, uh, you know, it was a, for their point of view, it'd be a good a good goal from a switch of play, middle of the pitch, out wide, cross into the box, and it's poor marking in the, the centre of the defence. You know, there's, there's no way you can uh, dress that up any other way. We're, we're, we're not tight enough in the box uh, so you know we've had situations where you know fans have been clamouring for you know changing in centre defence and we've, kind of, we've changed that over uh, a number of weeks now a few weeks we, we've had Ewan Murray in there obviously Kyle is, is injured and Ian Davidson was out down at Stranraer and we've changed that and whatever else you know but we still continue to, to lose goals so you know there's no uh, magic remedy there uh, Start the second half, we score a really good goal. I feel it's a well worked goal. I think we're, you know, towards the end of the first half, I thought we were well on top. Start the second half, get a good goal back, and looking to, to go on and, and win the game. You know, uh, we got a little bit slack on the ball, gave them a wee bit of encouragement. Uh, but the goal we lose again is a poor, poor goal. I mean, Callum plays into Jamie, Callum then goes by Jamie, Jamie loses the ball. Goes out for a throw in, they take it quickly, very straightforward to go forward in that side and deliver, you know, low to the back post where they get a tap and it's poor, poor, you know, you know, defending initially from losing the ball, you know, Callum shouldn't have go past Jamie, Jamie's got to take more care of the ball, then there's a reaction to the, the throw in, you know, poor, poor stuff, you know, in, in a game that I felt we were in good control, obviously we push forward then to try and get a, a, an equaliser, uh, you know, there was nothing in the game, but I'm fed up saying that as well. You know, I think we were probably overall the better of the team, but we end up losing the game, you know. What's the remedy to these defensive frailties that we have, John? You know, we've spoke across a number of weeks yeah. about you know throwing games away, about yeah. not being mentally strong enough. What What is the remedy for us? Well, obviously, Davey, we're not good enough, eh? you know. Let's face it, you know, it's, this is no new. This is no new, it's happening all the time. Now, if we were good enough, that wouldn't happen. We're actually no good enough. And we just have to face up to that, that we've got a characteristic of whatever you want to call it. We've got something that's missing. Something's missing. And, you know, we don't have a magic wand. We're not, we might not get that this season, you know. We can do it on certain days. We can do it, yeah. But overall, there is something missing. And unfortunately, we all have to live with that. We are having to try and, you know, organise the team. We've went a bit narrower to make us a bit harder to, to be beat. And yet, we do. It doesn't matter what formation we play. You know, we lose, we lose games. So, again, a few weeks ago, you know, it's when I'm saying wake up, smell the coffee, because it's you know your, your fans here, they're watching. I know they're not happy. No one's happy, but you know, unfortunately, that's where we are. This is where we are at the moment. We are no good enough. It's simple. You know, it's going to take a summer, a recruitment, and getting organised. Now, we have what is it, seven games to go, and we've still got an opportunity to go up. There's absolutely no doubt about that. And we'll do our absolute utmost, as we do every single week. But, you know, if we could have fixed it, it would have been fixed. You know? Has the greatest response got to be the one that's given by the 11 people uh, players wearing the jersey? Well, of course, definitely. We, we, we go in and we talk about it and we go over the same things all the time. All the time. You know? How cheap goals we lose. How often we have opportunities to, to score that we don't take. And how we end up feeling... You know, horrible on a Saturday at five o'clock uh, for the next, you know, over the weekend, into the early party next week, you know, and it's, you know, horrible, but, you know, uh, no one else is going to do it for us. We have to, you know, uh, kick ourselves out the backside when Monday morning comes along and, and get the, the players lifted again, and that's, that's, and that's what we do, but the repetition of what's going wrong is, is simple. We just don't have the actual, you know, Tools to do it. Thank you for your honesty, John. Catch up with you midweek. Cheers.